Hi, my name is Brian and this is Catherine. We're here today at the Canada Science and Technology Museum with our friends Tyler and Abby, where we'll be making circuits out of dough. So today we'll be making simple circuits using two different types of dough. A conductive dough that acts like the wires and an insulating dough that'll prevent the electricity from moving. To make the conductive dough, you'll need flour, salt, vegetable oil, baking powder, water, and food coloring. The special ingredient that makes the dough conductive is the salt. When the salt is dissolved in the water, the molecules split into positive and negative particles called ions. It is the ions which allow the electricity to flow. To make the insulating dough, you'll need flour, sugar, vegetable oil, and water. Unlike the salt, the sugar dissolved in the water doesn't break down into ions. The molecules remain neutral and cannot conduct electricity. So what we're going to do is we're going to light up this light bulb using this battery and making wires out of the green dough. So the electricity is going to travel around the green dough like a racetrack or a loop. And doing that, we should be able to light the light bulb. Are you guys ready to try it? Yeah. All right, let's get going with the dough. So now that you've both given me a piece of dough, I'm going to take this battery and hook it up to the dough. One wire goes in one piece of dough and the other wire in the other piece of dough. And then at the other end, I'll join the two pieces of dough with the light. Let's see if it worked. Whoa. Whoa, great job, guys. You made some good dough. Remember that when you're building your electric circuits, you can be as creative as you want to. As long as you have a path through which the electricity can flow, then your electric circuits will be successful. Be creative and try to come up with the most unique design. For more information on squishy circuits, come check us out on the web. Or come to the museum and learn how electricity is used in day-to-day -day life. See you soon.